In this video, we're going to be doing some mirror painting using a tapered pastel with rather low opacity setting and a low grain setting so that you get a nice pastel look. We're going to create a new layer and then we're going to turn on the mirror painting feature. Click on it and you will see the mirror painting line right in the middle. You can adjust it by switching it so you can have a horizontal or a vertical one or both at the same time. You can change the color of it which will change to red so it's a little easier to see. We'll pick our brush and we'll start painting. I've decided that I'm going to use just one brush in this whole painting and we'll just start. You can watch the rest of the painting as I go. You can see I've decided to do a face and mirror painting is really, really fast. It uh, speeds things up so that you can paint one side, the other side gets painted at the same time. Wonderfully quick way to work if you're using anything with bilateral symmetry or if you have a horizontal guide, it can make it so you're drawing in kind of a kaleidoscope fashion. Zoom in to paint on the face a little bit. I constantly adjust things as I paint. I'm not using any reference for this particular painting. I'm just painting away. It's funny because sometimes I will work on the right side of the mirror and sometimes I will work on the left side of the mirror. I don't know that there's any rhyme or reason for that. I just find that I do it now and then. Continuing to refine the face. I use as big a brush as possible. And the beauty of using one brush, you are able to concentrate on the painting and not change brushes. So I'm just working on one layer above the background using one brush. I am adjusting really only the color and the size of it. I'm going with the same opacity. I've zoomed in on this one to about 150%. The original image is 1600 by 1200 pixels. When you do this, depending on what you're painting, of course, you decide when you're done, when it's finished. It's just an extremely quick way to paint something where you want it to look symmetrical on both sides. It's also a great way of coming up with ideas if you are a little stumped for an idea. Make some scribbles using the mirror painting feature. Get some neck on this character. A little more in the hair. A little more blue eyeshadow. Don't know why I chose blue. It doesn't really matter. Paint some highlights in the hair a little bit. Highlights on the shirt collar. The original painting took about 30 minutes. This is obviously sped up. Again, using only one brush tapered pastel, and one layer. Added a new layer to paint some background in behind her. And we're just about done at this point. Change the radius for a few small details. getting close and you will decide when it's done but you should try this feature it's great to experiment with it's very creative I do a lot of character design using 
mirror painting. And if I'm stumped, I'll just warm up doing a quick mirror painting. So I hope you enjoyed watching this. I hope you're inspired to try mirror painting. Use only one brush. I just turned off the mirror painting there and see what you can do. It is very enjoyable. Again, this is in Peral Painter Essentials 6.